So I don't really know what's gonna happen. Oh, what? What? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck is that? Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the Evil Within. Hey, everyone, my name is Mike, and welcome back to the Evil Within. Such a confusing game right here. If you're wondering why I'm in the blood pool right here, I can't even tell you guys because I just got teleported right here while looking at the guy called Ruvik, who's the guy teleporting around like the hidden. And um, we just started walking down a coward corridor. And next minute, a pool of blood came flying towards us, and we opened our eyes, and we were here. We're in a pool of blood in a room we haven't actually been in before, so we're trying to figure out where we're going and get out of here and make. And the, we've been separated as well from the doctor and the patient Leslie and Doctor. What was his name? Jimenez or something? Right, there's a trap right in front of us there. <laughs> so let's crouch. Can we disarm it even though it's over there? Looks like that's too far away to disarm. So what can we do here? We've got some parts to pick up there. What I might do here, guys, is I might actually make some crossbow bolts. Okay, guys, I just made a bunch of crossbow bolts there. Just plenty of each one because I had loads of parts. And, you know, removing all those, um, those things, you know. So we're going to use the explosive one. Keep that equipped because it's the most... Fuck. Um, <laughs> it's the most effective one, and I only be there to use this weapon when there's a bunch of enemies, just because it's a quick kill. So there's, there's actually floating blood cells in the air there, you can see. It's a bit weird, I don't really know. I don't make any sense of anything that's happening right here. Okay, because there's a quite a lot of um, explosives there and stuff. I'm going to actually just go towards the door where that light came on. Um, maybe not, we're going... Okay, we're not going for that door. Here's Ruvik. Okay. What is this? He's sending a bunch of um, blood cells over there. Okay, he's wo he's awoken the horde. Alright, I'd say and put ourselves... I'm sure I'll pick this up. Let's put ourselves on this side. Okay, we've got quite a few. Let's, put the, let's try and use this explosive bolt on these. Okay, that's good, that's good. Let's um, crouch under this. Hopefully they don't get too close so we can make a distance between us. Now oh, they should blow up on that, right? Oh yeah, he's not coming back. He's an explosive on his face. He's not coming back, is he? Alright, they're definitely not- they're still coming back. What the fuck? Okay, can we burn this guy even though he's in the water? Yes, we can. I think the other two though that fell in the water, we can't burn them. Let's try this trap, see if it works. Oh, that's not good. We just brought another enemy out. Alright, we can set this light there. Let's shoot the lantern. That didn't work. That's great. That's, that's so shit. So let's ban some of these people. Now if this guy walks over here, we can ban him. Because there's a fire already up there. Right, he's, he's running off. I think he's the last guy left. Right, this guy's still alive. Let's ban him. He's not alive, but you know, he's not banned. We've got an incendiary bolt, haven't we? So I'm going to try that. If I can figure out how to equip it. Here we go. That's nice. Let's keep our distance though so he doesn't ban us. And the door is open. Good. What did this guy drop? He dropped some shotgun shells. That's good. I think that fireball is actually going to be pretty good to use against the pack of them. Because it looks like it shoots flames out from the sides. So it looks like it'd be damn good. Okay guys, I've just done a bit of exploring there. It wasn't really much to be picked up. And I was full on most of the ammo anyway, which is mainly pit pistol. So let's go through this door. Now that the blood wall has disappeared. And see what's next. This is crazy. Let's turn the flashlight off. It's quite... it's bright enough in here already. Alright, there's blood seeping from the walls. That guy doesn't seem to give a shit. Let's check this door. Okay, that's locked. So, um, let's carry on. There's a body at the end of the corridor right here. So that doesn't look like it's going to be a fun time. It's got a lot of blood hanging out of it. Guts. Uh, the room looks like saw. You know, the first saw with the, the guy face down. What have we got here? We've got ammo. No, we're already full on that. Alright, this doesn't look like a safe place, so let's see what this is. It's a dead end as well, so I don't really know what's going to happen. Oh, what? What? Hang on, what the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck is that? Um, 
Up this. There you go. Shit, I better run. Shit, I better run. Is it dead? Is it dead? It's banning. Oh yeah, it's not having that. We need to run. The guy just said to run, didn't he? So we're gonna run. Oh shit, the door. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Um, get in the door, get in the door, get in the door. Okay, okay, I think I've wasted that bolt on it because you can't kill it. Turn the flashlight on. I don't want to sprint because he runs out of breath, this guy, and stands still for like five seconds. So I'm just going to do a nice pace jog. There's some enemies on the ground there. We need, to, we need to just run, don't we? Get the ladder, get the ladder. Get the ladder. Right, get the ladder, get the ladder. Okay, there was um, a few things up there, like um, items and stuff and goo. But I'm not even going to play around with trying to pick that shit up when there's a spider lady chasing me with crazy hair. So, alright, these traps here, we're going like, to leave them be, so hopefully they will blow up on the... The spider lady. What is it with you? Yeah, don't don't turn the camera around. Let's just carry on going. Don't look back. Just fucking run. That's the plan here. There's a lift at the end. Oh, nice. It's open. It's open. There's a guy inside. Let's ban the guy. Fuck that. I'm not having him get up. All right. Okay, so she we, we, we left her behind. That's good. Oh fuck. All right. So. What's next then? So the guy's gone. He didn't drop anything. Let's get the pistol out. We've got plenty of ammo for that. What is that? I told him look at... Oh, fuck off. It's back. Um, run past it. Can we open this door? Is this door locked? No, it's not. Let's go. Why has it got an X on it if it's not locked? Okay. Need to make this shit. So spikes come up from the ground there. Let's just run. Fuck it, run. We need to run. Ooh. Yeah, no shit, mate. Fuck me. She don't piss about, does she? There's a box here. A way be a weapon inside? There's quite shotgun ammo inside. Alright, that'll do. We've got one shell from all that. So, for doing all that crazy shit, we got to be more to one shotgun shell. And there's probably some pistol bullets here. So, we're one bullet away from max there. We can carry 20 and have 6 in the, in the gun. We need some matches, though. That's the most important item at the moment, I think. Oh, fuck. Um, yep. Yeah, yeah let's, let's leave him. Let's run away. Because obviously I'm not going to be able to kill this guy, am I? Or am I? Should I kill him? There's nowhere to go up here. Should I shoot him? Oh, fuck! <laughs> um, what? Where am I going? Where's he gone? Um, hold on. Get away from the edge. I'll just fall to your death. Am I dead? make any sense so we we fell down a hole and ended up changing the laws of gravity and landed on our feet facing the opposite way yeah all right guys gonna make this one a short one just because we finished the chapter there we may as well start the next part at the start of the next chapter so thanks for watching guys and see you next time bye